So somebody asked me an interesting question. I will read it here. Since having a degree doesn't seem to be terribly important, is listing an incomplete computer science degree on a resume doing more harm than good? So that's the question put to me. I'll continue. I feel that pursuing the degree expresses an interest and knowledge of the industry in addition to having more than a high school education. However, by not finishing the degree, it could be conveying an inability to complete goals, projects, whatever. This is a good question. Very good question. So my answer was, if you don't finish the degree, better to have you better have a good reason to give. For example, I never finished my degree, although it wasn't computer science, it was psychology. And uh, but my reason is pretty uh, pretty credible. My business was taking off. That was one of the main main reasons. So I couldn't do a full time education and run a growing business. So that was my uh, my excuse, if you will. Well, the reality of the situation, although I never worked for anybody, so I never put that to the test. For me, as somebody who has hired people over the years, I don't really care about degrees to begin with because I'm in software and I just care more about resume and your abilities that you can demonstrate. That being said, if I saw somebody started a, a degree in computer science and, and gave even a slightly credible reason like like I saw, I, I saw more opportunity in my freelance work or I was offered a job as a developer full time. So I decided to take that and complete my degree or the degree was costing me too much money. I didn't want to go into student well in debt because, you know, in the U.S. perhaps. So I decided to just get into the work, into the field because I had skills already. Those to me are all credible degrees, uh, credible reasons uh, to drop out. Another thing. All the data is showing, like from the big players, from Apple and Google, that comp sci degrees are really, they're not the bee's knees. If you have it, great, fine. But it's not really as required anymore, except for some HR departments in some larger organizations. But if you're working for newer companies, more upstart companies, even Google is saying they don't care. That's what they're saying publicly. They don't care about degrees. And Apple released a study a couple of years ago, Apple, and I think it was Apple, IBM, or it could have been Apple, Google. Anyway, Apple is one of them. And they found that there was no performance advantage with people with a higher education versus people who didn't. So, yeah, there you go. It's uh, if you start the degree and for whatever reason you want to stop, just make sure you have a credible reason for it. At the end of the day, I don't think people are going to give they're going to care too much. The fact that you got in, they make, okay, you got in and shows a guy, this guy, this individual, guy, girl has the ability to get in. And that's good. Uh, that would be my thing. I would think, okay, they got in and they left. Why? Oh, because uh, I decided to go work. That's that's good enough for me. <laughs> you know, At the end of the day, you're going to be more judged on, you're going, to, you're going to be more judged on your portfolio and your ability to execute on code. And that's all about portfolio. That's all about your... Uh, your demo website, if you will, so that you can show the work that you can do and just be a good interviewer as well. So I hope that helps. Bye-bye.